Colombia to spend the summer. I figured I'll find a plastic surgeon there. I prayed on it first and I was led to Dr. Campbell. Um, when I saw his reviews and all the before and after pictures, I decided that was the doctor for me. So I called and I think I spoke with Andrea. It was refreshing to know that everyone spoke English because when you are in the United States and you hear things about Colombia, you think that it's old fashioned or that people are not gonna be speaking English. But after my first phone call, I was already happy. He didn't oversell me. He didn't give me false expectations. He told me exactly what I needed to hear for my body type. With the help of Andrea as well, she made us reservations to be picked up at the airport. And with a sign and everything, we felt special. We felt like celebrities. And uh, they put us in the taxi, drove us to the hotel. And um, from the hotel, Pedro called us and let us know that he's available to take us to see apartments and everything if we needed apartments. Um, I believe it was a Saturday, so I was pretty surprised that he was still working and, and doing everything on a Saturday at home. Nobody works on Saturdays or Sundays. First, we stayed at the Intercontinental. It was beautiful, but more than what we needed to spend for the amount of time that we were going to be here. We decided to be here two months and spend the whole summer, so we needed something more spacious. We went to look for apartments. Pedro helped us as much as he could. Um, and then we found an apartment uh, at the Palmetto Elliptic. And everybody here has been nice as well. The apartment is nice, very comfortable. Of course, we have the great view. So we're happy about that. My impressions when I came to the office was that it was amazing, it was beautiful. It wasn't what I expected back home or what I heard um, in the United States. Uh, the office was actually very high-end, very beautiful. Everybody in the office was dressed nicely. Everybody spoke English and everybody was polite and welcoming. So after that, after talking with him and, and doing the consultation, I was sold. I was. 100% in at that movement and um, in addition to him telling me what he could do he also let me know at that moment that it wasn't just him that was going to be doing it it was also his wife Dr. Carolina and to know that it was a team made me even more happy that it would be more than just one doctor it would be two doctors and he told me the history of their relationship and how he worked for the smile for a child organization and I knew at that moment that God answered my prayers and that I was at the right place at the right time with the right doctors. And they did more than I thought that they were going to do as well. Each one of the nurses made me happy. They became my family while I was here. I even did a little tree eye, but. During that time, before my surgery and after the consultation, I had about a week and a half to enjoy Colombia before I was going to be recovering for a while. So we decided to do everything we could in Catalina. We went to Playa Blanca. Um, other than Playa Blanca, we did the city tour. We got to see the church. I think it's called La Popa. We saw La Popa. We saw the es Castillo. Yes. Sala Castillo, got lots of pictures there, beautiful. Um, we saw the, we went to the old city, of course, walked around the old city and experienced old Colombia. It's beautiful. I couldn't get enough pictures of the old city. Um, all the restaurants there were delicious. All the people everywhere that we've been have been 
welcoming, loving, caring. Um, Colombian people are people that are at your service, that they want to serve you and make you happy. I had my follow-up at the office. I went to go see Dr. Campbell and Dr. Carolina. She and him were both there at that time to check me and uh, make sure everything was good. They changed my bandages every day, which was also a good thing. Um, I wasn't used to having my bandages changed every day. Um, but yes, they changed my bandages, they checked me up, they made sure my wounds were good and healing. They, at that moment, explained to me the procedure and everything that they did to me and uh, how it went. They said everything went well. They actually did more than I anticipated. I came in just to remove skin, but he actually performed a full tummy tuck at that time and made the muscles tighter, made the skin tighter to give me the appearance that I needed and wanted. So knowing at that moment that he did more than I even anticipated made me ecstatic, made me happy that that he is a doctor who doesn't worry about the time, he doesn't worry about the money, he worries about the patients. I would say that now after that I'm 100 30% happy. If I could surpass a hundred or a trillion, then I would. But I am more happy than I've ever been in my life. And I would say that's thanks to Dr. Alex and Dr. Carolina. And that they cared about me. And they cared about my results. And that they cared about my recovery. They cared about my comfort. They cared about my happiness. They cared about not only today, but the future. They also cared about the results of when I get home, that it's not gonna be something that someone will have something bad to say about. That they actually, I would say they're artists. They're artists, they're perfectionists.